So we just arrived at Kariftu Resort in Lake Bishuftu. So we did arrive early, so we're waiting for our room to check in. Um, so we're gonna have some Ethiopian lunch here first. Starting with bread. <laughs> Tracy and I are a little confused. We're not sure if like you're supposed to eat the leaf around the bread or not. I feel like it's just holding the garlic butter inside. That's really good though. Starting strong with their traditional cocktail. Very fruity. I it's like it. It's perfect for a hot day. Is there beer in it? I feel like there is beer in it. Yeah. It, it tastes like if you would take a sangria but remove the wine and put beer instead. I'm a fan. That's really good. So welcome to our room. We are in room 214 and I had to start out here. So our balcony has an amazing view of the lake. Now I'll show you inside. So we come in and we have a seating area here. There's even a fireplace in the corner, but something that is cool, if someone booked the room beside you that you know, you can actually open this door and have like a balcony for both of you type thing, which is really nice. Come in here, that is your entrance to your room from the stairs outside. Inside our room, we have a mini bar area over there, king size bed with mosquito net there, and bathroom. The shower is huge, like absolutely huge. I don't know if you noticed that yet, but uh, one little thing I did skip over actually, it's messy because that's where we put our stuff, uh, but you do have a closet too so that you can store everything away. So absolutely beautiful room. It's nice and cool because it's kind of like the traditional architecture, housing, that type of thing. Um, so it keeps the room nice and cool. So we are gonna sleep great, for sure. <laughs> Now this resort is massive, a lot of food option, a lot of things to do, a lot of activities, but there is one massive reason why I really wanted to come here because this place, Kiruftu Resort, has the only something in all Ethiopia. And we're going there right now. So we just switched to the GoPro, meaning that it's gonna be good. GoPro always means adventure. Yes, extreme. Okay, so we just made it to Kariftu Water Park. Once again, the only one in Ethiopia. It looks really cool. They have a bunch of different slides, but they also have like a shopping area, uh, a circus that we're gonna go check out later on. Uh, what else, Tracy? What else? They have food, bar, music. That's pretty much it. There's something for anyone in your family, tall, small, or young at heart. happens as soon as I get to the top below like when I was down below I was like oh it's not that high to be honest like I've done worse <laughs> And we got air as we went Yeah, over. we did get air and I'm gonna be honest, like at some point I thought we were gonna go yes. over the thing. But hey, it was super fun. Got a little sketched out there. <laughs> Whee! This was a little bit slower. It's still pretty fun. Oh, you're gonna get covered. <laughs> Something to note too is when you came in, I'm not, I have seen a couple people in bikinis, but the kind of consensus and on the sign is like, no really two pieces in the sense of like full and bikini. Um, so I actually chose to wear my shirt over top just because, to be respectful, majority of people are wearing one pieces or more, so just something to think about. So on our second one. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> <You're so fast. laughs> <laughs> This one is 
completely covered. But it's not too dark. So this water park has a circus, and that's what we're doing right now. <laughs> So a circus inside a water park that's inside a hotel resort. You think like it's such an afterthought that yeah. I had like very low expectation, but it was actually pretty good. Yeah. Especially my part. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> These things look like popsicle sticks. <laughs> so that was a good time. Um, yeah. It's not that big, but they're actually uh, doing an expansion. I think he said they're adding like six rides or something like that. Yeah. So it's going to be pretty cool. And you don't have to stay at the hotel to go to a uh, Carif 2 water park. You can just pay your ticket. I think it's like $31 so, um, during the weekend and $26 during the week. Something cool is that you can actually buy a package if you come there for the day. You can even buy a package yeah. that includes like food, food and a spa package. like. Just yeah. for a day trip. So there's fantastic. a lot of options. And if you stay at the hotel outside of the weekend, I think it's actually free. So anyway, yeah. good times. I'm a fan. Maybe we'll go back tomorrow. Okay, maybe not. We have a lot of things to do here. <laughs> so we just got back to our room and look what we found. Are you ready? Yeah. Got your phone, wallet, keys? I got my phone, got my keys, and of course got my Ridge Wallet who happened to be today's sponsor. So if you don't have your Ridge Wallet yet, well, you're sleeping and let me tell you why. First of all, it's very small, fits in every pocket without creating that massive lump in your pants that nobody wants. Second, RFID blocking technology, meaning that nobody's gonna be able to access the money on your credit card while it's in your wallet, which is pretty nice. And third, well, lifetime warranty because this is a quality product. And on top of great wallets, they also make these little key cases so no more loose keys in your pockets. So if you'd like to pick up this aluminum navy set or any of their 30 plus color and style for yourself or maybe for your dad because guess what father's day is just around the corner so make sure to visit the link in the description that's ridge.com slash dave manny to get up to 40 percent off on your purchase once again ridge.com slash dave manny up to 40 percent off on your purchase thank you to ridge for sponsoring this video So I'm so glad that we were told about this restaurant because by mm. default we would have went back to like the main buffet restaurant where we had lunch because we yeah. really thought that it was the only option but they yeah. actually have a second restaurant right down from our room about like two floors down basically yeah. and it's so nice. I think the reason why we missed it is because going to a room we're like, like you said, two floors up Higher, yeah. and so we never even thought to come down here but it is beautiful. To be honest, since we arrived in Ethiopia, we did try a little bit of international food like pizzas and whatever, but trust me, when in Ethiopia, eat like the Ethiopians because their Ethiopian food is just so, so good. Don't, don't eat pizza, don't eat pastas or any of that nonsense. Eat tips, because that's so good. And <laughs> shira. Well, that was a fun day, especially the water park. The food was good. I'm excited for tomorrow because we're doing some more cool stuff. Actually, we didn't really show you guys the, the, the resort yet. It's honestly, it's huge. It's massive. <laughs> so we're gonna go to bed. Do you have full of energy tomorrow? And until then... <laughs> I knew there was something going in. <laughs> yeah. there's, there, there's a lot of uh, rose petals everywhere. <laughs> So the, the prayer and the chanting on the loudspeaker started at 
3.30 until 4. They stopped from 4 to 4.40 and then from 4.40 till uh, now, 8 a.m. It's, uh, it's still going. We'll, uh, we'll sleep more tonight. How did you sleep? Good morning. <laughs> So the buffet is kind of divided in like two sections. You have like your international slash American breakfast with the potatoes, the egg, the sausages, bacon, and all that stuff. And then the other section is the Ethiopian food. And that's what we're gonna eat because like I said yesterday, when in Ethiopia, eat like Ethiopian, it's much better. So breakfast is great, um, but we're gonna start and do kind of like the rest of the resort tour. As you can tell, right here is the water park. That's where we were yesterday. So behind the restaurant at the water park where we just had breakfast, um, there's actually a big pool here with a swim-up bar. It's obviously not open right now because it's um, 9.20. But yeah, it looks pretty nice. Here's the reception. They even have a cinema here. Currently it is under construction, but when they have that renovated, that's gonna be a cool spot to be. So right here is the restaurant where we actually had lunch yesterday. And then over here is a bar. And then down there is the butchery where we had, actually that's kind of where we had lunch yesterday. Fantastic meat. So this resort is actually huge. Um, they have 150 rooms and you can kind of tell as you're walking around, like you're walking by the restaurants and stuff and the rooms are kind of just like hidden everywhere. <laughs> back to our room um, there's another wine slash bar area here it's not quite set up right now though but I feel like in the evening it would be a perfect spot to have like a glass of wine a little sundown area and then right over the edge of it down below is actually the second restaurant and that's where we had supper last night and there's a spa which we're gonna check out right now because I desperately need a massage I know David's not always a huge fan of massages. <laughs> it's because I work out all the time um, and I never do massages. So like, even if I ask for like a soft massage, it always hurt because like yeah. my muscles are filled nuts. So that's my fault. He just needs to do them more often yeah. basically. Um, that massage is absolutely fantastic. <laughs> oh, I could have laid there all day. Anyways, so right now, oh, fun fact. When you book here, you actually oh, yeah. get a complimentary 30 minute massage. Let's go into all the it's, details. It's, it's one massage per room. Yes. So we get an extra massage. Yeah. Yes. So complimentary massage per room. Um, you have free access to the spa, steam, and sauna. Mm -hmm. uh, you get access to something else we're gonna do pretty shortly. Yeah. <laughs> and like you said, depending on the day, like you always get a discount on the water park as well. And some days are free. Yeah, so I think- And breakfast. Yeah. <laughs> For the price point, like it's- It's really good. Amazing, yeah. So anyways, we're gonna- Enjoy the pool a little pool. bit. It's a little chilly. Yeah. And then we'll pick you up later. So one more thing that you can do here at Karuftu Resort that's also included, but sadly Tracy is not included, is kayaking. So you can just uh, sit back and relax. But again, you need a Tracy to a paddle. <laughs> give me, give me that sunshine, sunshine. Give me, give me them good times, good times. Nothing, nothing but good vibes, good vibes. Give me, give me that sunshine, sunshine. That was fun, but it made me hungry. That is really good. So for our last meal at Karuftu, we decided to try the buffet. Because it's a very popular option and we need to tell you guys if it's good. We stayed Ethiopian. Because in Ethiopia really... you eat Ethiopian food, except, sorry, for this mini burger. 
but it's pretty good. So another great meal, buffet, I would suggest as well. Yeah, I was kind of shocked. Like really good. They have between Ethiopian and uh, international. And the Just international, go for Ethiopian food. Yeah, but to be fair, the uh, international food wasn't that bad either. That, that's like, true. That's yeah. Anyways, this place definitely worth coming to. Yeah, one hundred percent. Like yeah. it starts depending on season and what kind of room you get and everything. It starts at about like one hundred and fifty dollar a night. But yeah. that comes like Tracy said earlier, like with the water park sometimes and like Half a massage, massage and the breakfast kayaking. and everything. Like, like you get a lot for your money. I think what kind of stands out about this place too is it can be everything from like romantic coupley yeah. to even being family friendly. Like when we had supper last night at the other place, like Super it nice. had a romantic feel. Yeah. But yet when you come out to the buffet or to the water park, like it's family friendly as well. And if you bring your kids and your wife, you drop the kids at the water park, you chill <laughs> with your wife around the resort. It's a win-win. So overall, like Tracy said, highly, highly suggested. Yeah. Just like when we went to Antoto, like Kariftu seems to be like a very nice collection. Collection, very nice company yeah. so we'll see if we can do one more the resort maybe we'll I really see. want to we're gonna try no promises yeah. uh, because we have a lot of plans and yeah. until then see you guys in the next one